EastEnders stars emotional London Marathon tribute unveiled, running in memory of beloved characters' tragic storyline. EastEnders' Jamie Borthwick reveals heartfelt reason for London Marathon run, honoring on-screen wife's memory in real life. Behind the scenes, EastEnders actors Jamie Borthwick and Emma Barton share challenges of filming and running London Marathon in character. Stars from EastEnders run the London Marathon as part of the brain tumor plot. As they approached mile 12 of the marathon, Jamie Borthwick and Emma Barton both acknowledged that they were struggling a bit. Actors Jamie Borthwick and Emma Barton from EastEnders are participating in the London Marathon in character as part of a plot involving a brain tumor. Danielle Harold's character Lola Pierce Brown, who was diagnosed with glioblastoma multiforme last year, was farewelled in heartbreaking moments from the BBC One soap opera. You may also enjoy the actors Borthwick, 29, who plays Lola's husband Jay Brown, and Barton, 46, who plays Honey Mitchell, announced on BBC One on Sunday that their respective characters would run the marathon in Lola's honor. We have seen a storyline where my wife Lola had developed a brain tumor over the last 18 months, Borthwick stated. Maybe our characters would run the marathon, our wonderful employer suggested to us as we worked hard to make it as realistic as possible. It's a really clever idea that EastEnders has done to show what a lot of people all over the country are doing, Barton continued. And that involves collecting money for their charitable causes or in a loved one's honor. We will be live filmed on the day of the London Marathon because Honey and Jay will be running it. The footage will be shown on Monday, April 22 at 7.30 p.m. This is a first for the history of soap operas. Really we're relying on all the people that are gonna come to London and just cheer us on and that's gonna just get us through and we're gonna love it," the actress continued, calling it quite daunting. The two were addressed by presenter J.J. Chalmers at the 12-mile mark. Borthwick declared, It's amazing. We are having some difficulty thus far. However, are we making it through? The throngs are really large. Everyone's been great, he continued. It's a fantastic day, and everyone is yelling and screaming, it's amazing. We just have to treat it like any other scene of EastEnders, professionally. We're going to get it done and then we can relax for the last half, Barton replied when asked if they were prepared for their EastEnders scene. With six wins out of a possible fifteen, the venerable BBC soap opera swept last year's Inside Soap Awards. Harold won Best Actress for her portrayal of Lola, Borthwick took home the Best Actor trophy, and Max Bowden, Ben Mitchell, was named Soap Superstar of 2023. BBC One will broadcast the EastEnders London Marathon episode on Monday at 7.30pm. As they get ready to run as Jay and Honey in the upcoming London Marathon, Emma Barton and Jamie Borthwick of EastEnders discuss the huge crossover with the soap opera. As they prepare for Monday's EastEnders episode, Emma Barton and Jamie Borthwick are filming for the London Marathon. In the BBC soap opera, the two actors portray Honey Mitchell and Jay Brown, who are participating in the marathon in remembrance of Lola Mitchell. The unfortunate figure, who was Jay's wife, lost her fight with brain cancer in 2023. In the present plot, Jay and Honey, who are married to Billy Mitchell, Lola's former foster father, train to run the race while they work through their sadness. However, while filming the serial opera, Jamie, 29, and Emma, 46, will actually be running the race for different causes that are dear to their hearts. Jamie is jogging on behalf of Prostate Cancer UK, and Emma is racing for BBC Children in Need. To record live scenes from the route on the day that will be included on the broadcast tomorrow night, they will both run portions of the race in character. Jamie and Emma tackled the difficult race at the same time as talking to broadcaster Gabby Logan about the difficult filming procedure. We're doing this on stage in memory of Lola, my wife who regrettably lost away from a brain cancer in the plot, Jamie said, describing how the notion came to be. Jay was put up to run the marathon by herself and Honey prior to her passing. Chris Clenshaw, our executive, declared, we're going to do it for real. How would you feel actually doing the marathon, was the idea that was thrust upon us. We foolishly agreed, and now look at us. However, because we are working today, our camera crew has four locations set up. We need to be at these locations, Cuddy Sark, London Bridge, and the finish line, and record a short clip. Emma went on to describe how challenging the shoot was, saying, Yeah!
We had a sort of meeting yesterday, like, can you be on the left side of this area, the right side of this, and we're like oh my goodness. It's crazy that we're running for our charities and enjoying this, but today is work day. Along the way, they indicated to them where the cameras and their other cast members would be, and they had areas marked out to let them know where they needed to go. Gabby inquired as to whether the two needed to make sure they were sprinting side by side for the cameras. Jamie conceded they would prefer that we do. We're hoping that it won't be too far if we split up. However, we'll have to wait and see on that day. The two had not been able to exercise together very much at Albert Square, Emma said, adding, not really, we've done our own individual training. We've completed a few tasks while at work. She went on to explain that she will be motivated to run the marathon by listening to dance music from the 1990s. Emma turns to reveal Honey written on the back of her shirt, and both actresses are running under the identities of their characters to add credibility to the performance. However, the hard work won't end when the marathon is complete because the footage still needs to be processed so that it can appear on Monday night. Emma clarified, saying, normally we're approximately eight weeks in advance. This short turnaround is really rare for the show. Thus, they will shoot this today, go back to Elstree, and edit it for the program tomorrow. Jamie recalled how he and his castmates had raced the London Marathon in 2019 in support of Barbara Windsor, who had received an Alzheimer's diagnosis. The EastEnders icon passed away in a London care facility in December 2020 at the age of 83. For the lovely dame Barbara Windsor in 2019 with Scott Mitchell, who we all know, he declared. Everything went really well, we had a terrific time on the day, which seems like it was five months ago, but it was actually five years ago. Crazy how it's all happening again. Executive producer Chris Clenshaw discussed the plot in his remarks, we're excited to celebrate our city and give our viewers a never-before-seen glimpse of the historic day through the characters of Jay and Honey as they participate in the event. The London Marathon is a landmark occasion in the capital. The people of Walford were deeply affected by Lola's passing, and this narrative will follow her loved ones as they continue to process her passing and pay tribute to her legacy. Jamie Borthwick of EastEnders gives a heartfelt explanation for his character's decision to run the London Marathon. Actor Jamie Borthwick of EastEnders has disclosed that he is running the London Marathon in the role of Jay Brown in memory of his late on-screen wife Lola Pierce. Actor Jamie Borthwick of EastEnders has disclosed that he is running the London Marathon this year in the role of Jay Brown as a memorial to his late on-screen wife Lola, who passed away from a brain tumor. The 29-year-old actor, who has been portraying Jay since 2006, shattered the hearts of fans with his struggle to accept Lola's death. Therefore, the producers of the BBC serial opera decided to enter Jamie, who plays his character, and Emma Barton, who plays Honey, in the 26-mile marathon in an effort to bring the heartwarming plot into reality. Along the route, cameras have been installed at the London Bridge, the Cuddy Sark in Greenwich, and the Mall, where the race ends. Before filming began, he said, We're doing this on screen in memory of Lola, my wife who sadly passed away from a brain tumor in the storyline, so herself and Honey before she passed, put Jay up to do the marathon. He was speaking to sports reporter Gabby Logan. Well, we're going to do it for real, our executive Chris Clenshaw suggested, letting us know how we felt about actually running the marathon. We foolishly agreed, and here we are, he continued. However, Today is actually a business day for us, so, our video crew is set up at the finish line, London Bridge, Cuddy Sark, and this location. Yeah, we had a sort of meeting yesterday and it was like can you be on the left side of this area, can you be on the right side of this, continued Emma, who has been playing Honey since 2005. It's insane. In addition to running this for our charity and having fun, today is also a work day. Jamie said that while the bosses would prefer it, it is not necessary for the plot for them to run side by side. Emma disclosed that they have been practicing separately and occasionally together while on set, so it appears they have been taking things seriously. The actress is also listening to Run DMC, a 90s rap group, to help her stay focused and finish the race. Jamie had already raced the London Marathon in 2019 in memory of his late renowned co-star Barbara Windsor, who died in December 2020. Sadly, six years prior, she had received an Alzheimer's disease diagnosis. Jamie talked about how fast time has gone by, 
claiming that although he felt like it was only five months ago, it was actually five years ago when he ran the marathon to support a dementia campaign. This specific moment won't need to wait eight weeks to be on screen, it will air in tomorrow's program. Please subscribe our channel.